Bali Island, Indonesia. Bali has been populated since prehistoric times. After the 4th and 5th century, Hindu traders brought their religion to the island, but little else is known about this time. After that Bali was under the Majapahit kingdom, and many more tumultuous regimes for a while. Different tribes blossomed at this point. Then the landmark time for European colonialism was the 16th century, when Dutch settlers arrived at the city. This influenced many parts of Balinese culture, and created a hybrid of architecture in the area. In 1710, the Dutch people conquered the existing regime, and Bali was brought under their control. Dutch rule was short-lived, however, because Indonesia was soon conquered by Japan during World War II. Since then, Bali has been propped back on its feet by tourism, that boomed in the 1970s. Bali is noted for its wooded volcanic mountains, distinctive rice paddies, beaches, and coral reefs. Religious sites such as the cliffside Uluwatu Temple can be found on the island. Bali is a city where religious beliefs influence almost every aspect of life. It is home to one of the unique forms of Hinduism, even though Indonesia's population is predominantly Muslim. Balinese Hinduism and Buddhism are the most practiced religions in Bali, with various temples dedicated to both faiths. Balinese Hindu festivals are different from Indian Hindu festivals, and their customs and traditions are also vastly different. Kuta, a coastal city with bustling bars, is to the south, while Saminyak, Simu, and Nusa Dwa are prominent resort towns. Yoga and meditation retreats are also popular on the island. Bali, Indonesia's most famous island, is located to the west of Java in the Lesser Sunda Islands. It is world-renowned for its scenic rice terraces, fragrant cuisine, stunning beaches and a galore of culture and tradition. With its elaborate temples, endless coastline, some of the world's best coral reefs, waterfalls and retreats, Bali combines leisure and adventure impeccably. A dizzying combination of spiritual awakening and hard partying all into one, Bali is where people from all over the world come to lose themselves in. The island boasts some of the best sunsets and sunrises, enough to captivate and entice you into never leaving this place. Home to the coral reefs of Tulumbay, the mountain peaks of Kintamani, the beaches and scenic routes of Saminyak and Kuta. With ancient temples and traditional village life of Ubud, Bali's charm is boundless, as are its opportunities for fun. Don't forget to stop by one of the many terraced rice fields, a feature that only adds to the diversity of Bali's beautiful landscape. Tourists may enjoy an idyllic day at the beach, surf, dive, take a casual boat ride to gaze at the dolphins, explore the many beautiful temples, the local markets and the waterfalls, or go to the silent yoga retreats, there is something for everybody here. Bali has been the subject of so many travel journals and has been famously alluded to in many works of literature, as a place of true beauty. And yet words always fail to capture the captivating magic of the island of the gods. Nightlife at Bali only really starts after midnight, with most of the popular clubs opening around that time. With the western concept of bars and clubbing gaining ground, Kuta and Saminyak are the best places to find popular clubs. Fridays and Saturdays are particularly good days of the week for a night out. Bali became the only portion of Indonesia where Hinduism still reigns supreme. The people who live on the islands of Bali's east coast are predominantly Hindu, and there are Hindu communities sprinkled throughout Java's eastern shore. The introduction of Indian traders brought Hinduism to Bali. Hinduism, long before Islam, became the people's primary beliefs through rituals, traditions, and the arts. It is safe to travel alone in Bali, even if you are a woman. It is fairly normal for visitors to travel about the island alone. Take the same precautions as you would in Australia and be cautious when it comes to your personal safety. Bali is already the most expensive tourist destination in Indonesia, and it is only getting more expensive as more tourists discover the island. However, if you don't mind basic accommodations, stick to your budget, and bargain respectfully for prices, cheap food and lodging are still widely available. Bali is most famous for Tana Lot Temple, Uluwatu Temple, Basaki Temple, Tegalalang Rice Terraces, Ubud Monkey Forest, Ubud Art Market, Kintamani, Bali Safari and Marine Park. The most beautiful places to visit in Bali. The Sea of Golden Marigolds Basaki. The Temple in the Clouds Karangasam. The View over Kelinking Beach Nusa Penida. The Emerald Green Rice Terraces Jatilubi. The Kampuhan Ridge Walk Ubud. The Yellow Bridge of Love Nusa Lembandan. Mistakes to Avoid in Bali. 
one wearing a cross body bag, two having anything on show in the monkey forest, three trusting the weather apps, four visiting popular waterfalls like Teganamin in the middle of the day, five staying in Kuta, six not venturing out of the southern part of Bali. Ubud, Saminyak, Kambu, Uluwatu, and Kuta are the greatest places to stay in Bali. To see the most beautiful sights in Bali, divide your time and stay a few nights in the top 2 to 3 areas. Holidays spent with family are far more enjoyable than those spent alone. To ensure that your family and you have the most thrilling time possible. Indonesia offers the top attractions in the country. Allow the youngsters to run about in our fantastic theme parks. To achieve the most exhilarating rafting experience, have the courage to explore rivers. Hope you liked the video. Do like and subscribe. Keep watching.